My senses were heightened by the accident, not destroyed. In particular, I have an acute sense of hearing. Sometimes, if you listen real closely, I can even hear inside people's thoughts. The old lady, she never did me anything wrong. She never hurt me or insulted me, but there's one thing in particular about her. I obsessed over it night after night. It was her big, brown, ugly, naughty mullet. Each night, I snuck into the old lady's room. I very sneakily, very cunningly opened the door, snuck in, and gently turned on the lantern. old lady barely even knew I was there. Last night, that girl, she came into my room and turned on a really bright light. The next night, the old lady was doing some weird mullet dance ritual. night the old lady was studying. I don't even know what she was studying. I mean, she doesn't even go to college or anything. What? Oh. <laughs> Why? So, I was going just like that big inhale. And long exhale. And gently relax your hands back down on your thighs, coming back to your breath here. Great, right, so just tip over to your right side here, bring your right hand down toward the ground a bit, soften up your elbow, reaching this opposite arm, all the way bit over. Nice, gentle opening in your sides, just breathing a whole lot. And when you're ready, gently bring yourself all the way back up to real, and same on the other side, just tipping over, hand finds the ground, soften up your elbow, keeping both sides of the waist nice and long, deep, full, big breath. And when you're ready, gently bring yourself all the way back up to your middle, and then we'll walk forward here a little bit up to you. It can be just a couple steps if you feel like that's enough to get things moving here. If a few more steps feels even better, go for that. And just let the weight of your head and neck soften into the ground here, just breathing a whole lot into the back of your body. All right, so <coughs> you're crawling yourself all the way back up. From that one here, we'll press your fingertips right behind you on the ground as you push down with your chest right upward toward the ceiling. Maybe to lift your hips a little bit here if that feels nice. Just make. I mean, I was just doing my yoga. You got to stay limber. The next three nights were karate. Oh. night I took her and I stuffed her in a giant bear suit I just had randomly laying around the house and then I chopped off her hair but only to find out it was a wig all along I took the wig and I put it on my dog the most unsuspicious place I could think who's there Thank you.
pops. Hi, ma'am. May I come in? Sure. Yes, I'm here over a report neighbors sent in saying there were screams coming from this house. Oh. Uh, yeah. And see, I was watching The Bachelor last night, and when Ted gave that final rose to Zoe over Nikisha, uh, a little bit of me died inside and was like buried under the floorboards. Like, I just felt like someone was just ready to chop off my limbs. I could hardly keep my big eyes open. Ma'am, I understand. Zoe belongs in a dump. Nakisha, she was a jewel. I mean, she could even be a diamond. Not breakable. Unbreakable. Unbreakable. Alright. I know, it's just, that's, that's all that was going on. I know, ma'am. But my job, it is breakable. So I still have to look around. Alright. I'm done. Everything looks pretty good here. Great. Do you want some unsuspicious cookies? Ma'am, I would love some unsuspiciousness in my life today. Alright, let's go. So I got these unsuspicious cookies. Great, I love um, pepper charm cookies. They're amazing. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> yeah. Um, where'd you get that? Um, I, I found it on your dog. Oh, yeah. Um, you know, I just really love dressing up my dog in mullets because, you know, that's the in thing is dog mullets. <laughs> yeah, um, okay. I've never heard that one before, but okay. So, uh, so who's that? <laughs> oh, oh, this is, um, this is my friend who, uh, ha, is not dead at all. He knows. He knows. Yeah, she did, she definitely didn't do it. I oh, um, <laughs> funny story. He just went to a Halloween co uh, <laughs> costume contest, which is why he's dressed like a giant bear, and and a little too many Twix bars. So <laughs> he might not move ever. <laughs> again, like, at all. Um. <laughs> Paralyzed for life. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know, I, I heard Twix bars can do that. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah. Yeah, um. So. Um, I went to a Halloween costume contest once. I was a giant butterfly. All my friends were like, you're so beautiful, you definitely win. But there was this girl, she was a giant fairy. I mean, fairies are magical. How can you beat that? Uh-huh. And, you know, there's this one girl, she was dressed up like Zoe from The Bachelor. I'm like, no, no, nobody's okay, gonna vote. Okay, okay, alright, I did it. I killed him and I put him in a giant bear suit. Um, uh, okay. Um, well, ha have a nice day then and see you around. You're not gonna arrest me? Oh, uh, no, nah, you watch The Bachelor, you can't be that bad. Okay, here's me.